the energy vibration reading for the Pisces Sun Moon and Rising it is the last week of eight of May 2018 and the week begins um, from the 28th until the 3rd of June um, please remember to listen to your monthly readings thank you for your like shares and support and I want to say thank you for being here um, the energies in this week is the energy of the lovers so it's going to be a wonderful week so expect a lot of surprises new start and um, a situation with the Prince of Sto Sword there's a new start in the energy of the Prince of Swords there's rest that is going to be coming in there is the um, King of Wands in the reverse form be careful of this person the Knight of Pentacles nine of protection is coming in and you're um, you're hoping up to whatever is coming in there is happiness in this week finally finally happiness looks coming in for you and um, Pisces this is wonderful your weak energy is looks of abundancy love coming in but you have to be careful because we have to deal with all these people so if your father is a Aquarius Gemini or Libran he's gonna be okay there's a new start that is coming in for him so if he was sick or that sort of a thing there's a positive energy that is coming in if your father is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius your father or mother is a Aries Leo, Libra or Leo or Sagittarius there is a situation that is happening with him he needs to take some rest as we look forward for um, the people who are dealing with the Pisces um, with the um, um, Taurus Virgo and Capricorns um, you are going to really have in a situation with these people but it's a new start coming in what I'm seeing for the weekend is the energy of information coming at speed to you. Whatever is happening, there's a lot of information coming at speed. If there was um, unbalance in your financial situation, that is going to be balanced out. You have the wheel, the magician. So new start. Um, if you're a creative person, this week is a very good week for your creative endeavor. The energy of the angman is in reverse some of you are having a situation that has to do with the Aries Leo and Sagittarius so you have to be careful you have the energy of the two of ones there is a new offer that is coming in from someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and you have in a strength with this new start okay so whatever is happening whatever is coming in it's going to be positive some of you are going to be connecting with someone who is um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion or this could be you you ladies um, between the ages of 18 and 45 you're going to be very very happy and receiving looks of abundance in your life the energy of wealth is here energy of wealth come in and this is coming in in a positive way so as we look at the energy of a new start with this person who is an, um, an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libran there is the energy of the five of Pentacles which could be doing with his health so we're going to look there's information that is going to be coming out and it's about money coming to this person so um, this is good so if you were having financial instability now it's going to be um, positive okay so new start again comes up so a lot of you Pisces are going to be having a new start some of you could be having this in the first half of the week and if it's 
a situation where your your wife or um, your mom or a family member um, you know there was a situation you are going to be receiving this positive start energy of the Sun comes out so if any one of your parents or having health issues or yourself is having and health issues um, it could be that it is going to be coming better but it's also a sign of success for other people so um, there is going to be a wonderful new start that is going to be happening for you because this new start has the energy of the Sun of success that is also coming with this new start and this is going to be good um, your numbers is going to be number one number one is positive a lot of you are going to be working with the Aquarius the Gemini's and um, the um, Aries the Leo's and the Sagittarians some of you are going to be working with the Taurus the Virgos and the Capricorn whoever is working with the Taurus Virgo and Capricorns they are going to be bringing financial stability into your life which is going to be very possible some of you who are creative a lot of information a lot of new ideas are going to be coming up at you and this is going to be good um, if you are working with um, someone who is an Aquarius and that sort of a person they are going to be seeing this energy that is coming out from you and going to be seeing and giving you a brand new start a brand new push and this is going to be good some of you have to be aware of this woman um, that is an Aquarius over the age of 40 be aware for this woman okay whatever the situation is this woman is out for blood but be aware for this woman whoever she is it's not a very positive person and um, you need um, to be aware of her whatever she is planning on doing the energies is not really you have to look within because this woman is not very um, honest and is a devious person so be aware so if you are dealing and um, it could be the energy of your mom so be aware what is happening it could be the energy of your mom but it could be someone who has entered your life and she's not saying the truth so hold her off at a distance okay please just hold her off at a distance there is an opportunity that is going to be opening up for you take this opportunity because this opportunity there's going to be a lot of work to be done but know that you have the inner strength to go the distance to make it happen do the work this is what the angels of abundance is saying do the work that is needed for you to make this opportunity go in your favor just do the work focus on the work less talking more work and you are going to be seeing that you are going to be receiving what it is that you need okay I want to say namaste until next time